A developing story, the husband of a woman found dead in the woods is pleading for investigators to find the person responsible. Debbie Collier disappeared earlier this month and sheriff's deputies found her body naked and burned some 60 miles away from her Athens home in Habersham County. Channel 2's Audrey Washington reports from Athens tonight with details. And I'm here at the Athens Clark County Police Department because this is where the 59 year old was first reported missing. Today, sheriff deputies in Habersham County told us the murder was deliberate and personal. Surveillance video recorded from outside a family dollar in Clayton, Georgia showed Debbie Collier leave the store and then sit inside her van for about 10 minutes. Before Collier left the store, more surveillance videos showed her buy a number of items, including a tarp and a red tote bag. The next day, that same tarp and bag were found next to her nude and badly burned body in Habersham County on September 11th. The day before, deputies say Collier wired her daughter about $2,400 dollars along with a mysterious message. Right now, investigators have no suspects in the case and no exact cause of death, but they say this was not a random murder. The husband of Debbie Collier says he wants the person responsible behind bars. I would like the sheriff to solve this. We do not believe that this is the act of a serial killer. We believe that this act was deliberate and personal. And deputies told us they should have more information once those autopsy results are released. And we are here in Athens tonight. Audrey Washington, Channel 2 Action News.